Okay, in this tutorial, we're going to do a green screen effect um, where you're not going to really lose the, the finer details of the subject, um, such as their hair um, or the outer um, edges of their clothing or skin. So um, let's get started, and we're going to click on the video footage down here on the timeline, um, come up to Effect, Keen, and down to Key Light. And choose from the the color the screen color picker um, choose a grain close to the subject and as you can see here we've got a little bit of gray or shadowing going around the subject so we are going to take care of that right now by um, building a junk mat um, that will protect um, Tim who happens to be my subject here um, and prevent um, when I do use key lights screen gain correction and also under screen mat the clip black correction um, to prevent losing any hair and also the finer details so we're gonna build this junk mat safety barrier by clicking on the video footage on the timeline come up to layer down to auto trace so we're, let's build this this um, barrier right now. Let's go ahead and click preview so we can see how the outline of the trace will be. Um, click work area for the time span so that way the entire um, ten and a half seconds worth of video is, is traced. Uh, make sure alpha is selected for the channel. Um, tolerance leave it one. It should be set that way by default. Um, threshold. This is the one that you can. This is the one that a lot of people will adjust back and forth. Um, I happen to know for my footage, I need 60. And and make sure that you do not hit enter. You click off to the side to keep the value. If you hit enter, it'll actually um, activate the OK. Um, minimum area we're going to leave at 10 and corner roundedness at at 50 percent. And the last bit before we hit OK is apply to new layer and click OK. Auto trace is finished and now we are going to um, do a little bit of an expansion here on our on our junk mat um, because um, we just need to make sure that uh, you know everything is going to we're going to be able to have enough area going around his hair um, to protect and be able to make sure that we do a, a proper keen um, so we don't lose his hair um, and especially and also the the edge of his clothes here so um, what we're going to do is select the auto trace um, down here on the on the uh, timeline and go up to effect down to mat and to simple choker and I'm going to toggle the the choke mat and as you notice here, the values go from negative 10 to positive 10. I happen to know that I actually need a value of negative 25. So if you do want to go beyond uh, the negative slider or the positive, you do have to manually type in the value. So negative 25, and that will actually expand my mat um, to give it a little bit more depth. Next, I'm going to go ahead and get rid of everything here that's in the, the the green screen the transparency part so what I'm going to come down here and do on I'm going to select my regular video footage um, if you don't see track mat um, listed here click the button down here it says toggle switches slash modes I'm going to choose from the drop down alpha mat and as you can see everything that's from the green screen is gone I do see here that I do have a little bit from my expanded um, simple choker on, on my screen mat here that I do have a little bit of gray going around that but this is is what's cool I can now control what actually gets keyed by um, using my key light settings so I'm going to make sure that I've got my video footage selected so my key lights up here and I happen to know that screen gain for this footage, footage is 105 and clip black is 20 and as you can see here his hair looks pretty good I'm gonna go ahead and move on the timeline to make sure that nothing just all of a sudden wigs out even though his hair his hair is moving with the fan that we had in there it looks like a pretty good key I'm gonna go ahead and insert from my project panel my beach footage and as you can see um, Tim is now at the beach and he's enjoying life
for more information on how to use a junk mat using uh, for green screening, um, visit tv.adobe.com and search for Super Tight Junk Mats by Creative Cow.